talking about. Okay, hey, Marshall. Alright lads, welcome to the first ever episode of the Manchester United career mode on FIFA 21. My name's Arlan for Set Play Gaming. As you can see, I've spent about an hour creating Pochettino. Not quite him, but it's a close enough resemblance. I did use a YouTube um, tutorial to help me with it. And we'll roll with it. You know, let me know in the comments what you think. Um, he's going to be the manager. It's a two-year deal and uh, takes charge Hopefully to get us, uh, keep us in the top three and do well in the Champions League. So, considering the brand objectives we have, we're going to take a look at them and head into pre-season as well, play some games and see how that goes. The brand objectives, the first one is to uh, make sure we continue to score, get a streak of 15 games with at least one goal scored this season. So the board won attractive, uh, expansive attacking football. I'm sure we can deliver given the players we've got. And uh, the youth development, they actually want us to sign three players younger than 20 years old with a potential greater than the average overall rating of players currently in the same position. I think we can do that too. Let's get to those pre-season games and see how we get on. Here we are in France. We're going to be taking on three teams. Celta Vigo is the first team that we take on in pre-season. As Pochettino looks to impress Pogba. He's found Martial. He's in behind the back line. Go on, Martial! Oh! You put your, your house on him scoring that. Tries to place it just past the post. Giving it away. United it's a good ball. Oh, look at that. Here. Bruno into Martial. Chance here. And a goal. Come on. English press said he had no chance. 50 million down the drain. Tony Marshall scores again. Get in. What a start. It's taken half an hour. But Marshall here. That lightning pace. And a really good take. Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely Our next game, we, we have Italian keeper. opposition really against Genoa, finish. so probably going to go with two first teams well, in the opening the two games. Look at Pochettino the there. He's happy with that. Now. This is far from so am I. Pogba. Bruno. Into Pogba. Hasn't quite got the legs. Pogba. Oh. Somehow reaching it. Be nice if Pogba can get a goal this pre-season. He's definitely a confidence player. It's a good save by the goalie, Sergio. Half time the approaching. Hornikit. Maguire! Oh! Well, it's a strong save, isn't it? He certainly earns his wages well, there. Derek, you're right. He has played well and goals. So half time games. comes round. We have a 1 0 lead. Couldn't have gone any better, half. really. Just need that second goal. Pogba. Bruno. Maguire's halfway line. Martial oh, giving away. Martial hunts him down. Oh, giving away again. Break. Bruno. Come on. Pogba. Into Pogba. Into James. Through. Danny James. In behind the back line. Oh, he saved it again. Anthony Martial. Martial. Bruno, there's the runner, it's Paul Pogba, chance for United, squares it, it's Martial, it's his second, come on, Martial with the brace, just after the hour, Pogba knew there that he was probably going to be caught, and did the unselfish thing, and his compatriot Frenchman, Grabs himself a brace. The goalie. And there's full time. We win 2 0 against Celta Vigo. A great win on our opening match. So for game two, as you can see, we've got Romero in goal and are giving Alex Tellers a try. 
Might as well see how we get on with Alex Tellers as our new left back signing. Hello everyone, our travels have taken us to southern France. Take on Genoa. Most of these teams, I think, are going to be Europa League quality, so we should be able to get some wins. That's a good ball by Van der Beek. James into Marshall. Opening five minutes. Come on! Marshall again. It's his third goal of pre season. Woohoo! Come on! It's only taken five minutes. Van der Beek through to James in behind the back line. And look at all the net he's got to aim at there. He doesn't go for placement this time, Martial. Play it down for Genoa there. Van der Beek. Fernandez. That's a wonderful ball. Alex Tellers on the bounce. Oh, and the, the goalie Perron had to save it. He's got a heck of a shot on him. Rashford. Rashford. And now Bruno to Van der Beek. And Perron saves again. Interested to see how we can fit Van der Beek into the team without him becoming a true rotation player. He should be in the first team, but we've got that many good midfielders. Van der Beek wins it back. Oh, and look at this. Intercepted. And look at this. Oh, Van der Beek brought down. Referee. That was lovely footwork. And a lovely interchange of passes. And that's this guy's name. Corrado goes into the uh, uh, referee's book. It's a yellow card. It's a lovely interchange. And then look at this turn from Van der Beek on the edge of the box. Chance for Bruno early on here. Half an hour played. He's going to go for that top corner. Oh, it's gone over. It's too He'll central it's that. Oh, Perron makes a stop. Well, All right, calm down. The cursor went back over. I wanted to try and pick that corner out there. Shona. Sliding challenge from Baye, but he still managed to get it away. Sliding challenge again. Genoa threatening to, to get a goal here. They still haven't got the ball in. He comes in and Tellers with a great leap. Some good athleticism there. Half time. And we have a 1-0 lead. I feel like this is a game where if we don't get a second goal, they might get an equaliser, so we need to be a bit more clinical. Van der Beek, wonderful pass. His range of passing today has been great. James in behind the back line. Danny James to Marshall. Owen. One of the defenders got a foot in. Van der Beek. Bruno. Wan Bissaka. It runs past him. James. Oh, Marshall. I thought he was going to score there. He spurns his chance to get the, the brace. He kind of misconnects it, actually. Doesn't make a good contact on it. And Marshall goes off. On comes the new boy, Edinson Cavani. Let's see what he can do. Free kick. Crossed in. Oh! Oh, we almost conceded there. Radovanovic. It's actually Pogba trying to mark him. That is so close. Cavani. Great centre forward play. Van der Beek. Precise ball Shot's not on. Edge of the box. Chips it up. Pogba's in the box. Pogba! Yes! Come on! Paul Pogba. We needed a goal from him. As I said in the first game, Pogba is a confidence player. And you get this guy rolling, he can be a real asset to the first 11. And I'm actually playing him in a more familiar central midfield role. He's pushed a little bit further ahead of the CDM. It's an easy finish from there. And we do have that second goal now. It's cleared. Nodded down. Kept alive. Pogba. Headed down. Cavani's in there. Cavani! Yes! Come on! It's three. And Edinson Cavani gets his first. A striker who has been signed at the twilight of his career, really, at the end of his career. 33 years old, but making a nuisance of himself and then shows the predatory instinct to finish. 
Look at this finish here. Lovely finish. Doesn't panic. Hopefully you get some more from him. And the full-time whistle is 3-0. We roll on to the final game against Strasbourg. So as you can see, we've got Strasbourg in the next game. Henderson's going to be in goal. And uh, Cavani starts. It's mostly a rotated lineup here as we take on Strasbourg in the third game. We've won two. So we're actually through to the semi-finals regardless of what happened here. And it's just good to try and get some fitness up for these players. Mata. Chips into the box. It's Cavani. Brings it down. Oh. Cavani. Wide. And it's Pelistri. Pelistri cuts inside on Lala. Pelistri. Oh, his shot's blocked. Mata. Fred. Van der Beek into Cavani. Yes. Come on. It's Cavani again. Cavani scores. And we have a 1-0 lead against Strasbourg here. Well, it is good play. You might question the defense, Lovely little build-up play. Boxing. Van der Beek really again showing his and an easy finish. creative well, skills. Again, albeit from a different angle. Highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. We just try and keep this attack alive here, Strasbourg. Thomason. Matiba! Oh, and a good save. Well played. Great save from Henderson. Really good save. So at half time, it's 1 0. Cavani with the crucial goal. And we're hoping that the battle for the second spot in rotation goalkeeper between Romero and Henderson will be interesting. Van der Beek. Rashford is through. Rashford. Hey, 2 0. 20 minutes left. 15 minutes left, actually. 75 minutes. And Rashford has put the nail in the coffin here. Well, I can tell you, Derek, when I got into Van der Beek position, again, two assists stations, for him in this game. Rashford can. just well, powers his way through. Finish in step in the goal. And a lovely finish on the instep. Goalie got no chance there. Really delighted with that goal, I'm sure he is. And the full time whistle does go. It's a 2 0 win. And we meet, I think it's A bar in the semi finals. We'll get to that game next. As you can see, we've got the semi-finals. Ajax and Genoa are in the other one. I'd imagine that Ajax will get through that. So we need to make sure that we beat Ibar in this semi-final. As you can see, we're going a full-strength side. I think we'll be able to do it. Um, don't really see anybody there that we should be worried about. So semi-finals. Hello everyone. We're back at the Orange Velodrome to take on Ibar. And as you can see there, the Pack the Princes is the location for the final. The player to watch is Bruno Fernandes. Pogba, Fernandes, wide to Rashford. Rashford cutting in. Rashford! Chance for Rashford. Oh, and what a save by Dimitrovic. Matic keeps it alive. Pogba. Oh, and his shot's blocked. Pogba, some good pressure there. Oh, look at this. Bruno. Bruno to Martial. Oh, and a save by Dimitrovic again. That half time. Ibarra frustrating United. Uh, hopefully we can get this winning goal. How can he take them on and beat them? Diop. Pogba trying to get the ball off him. Pedro Leon. Be a bit of a, a bad result Diop. if we lose here. Alvarez. Oh, it's played in. Inui. Oh, and a good save. De Gea parries it away. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the That's a good ball. Rash. It's Marshall to Bruno. 
Oh no, given away. James contests it. Pogba keeps it alive. Bruno again. Bruno into Rashford on his right. Come on! Just before the hour, the man of the hour, Marcus Rashford. He scored in the last game. And he scored here. Bruno had originally gave the ball away, but he Pogba kept the attack alive and Bruno picked out a pass. And again, another finish on his instep. It's a lovely finish. 20 minutes left. Wan Bissaka. Martial into Bruno. Pogba. And now Fred. And now Martial. Oh, and he, as he turned around, Dimitrovic were right on top of him. Four minutes left. Tellers. Fred. Kept just alive. Alex Tellers. He's got a shot. Oh, and it's blocked. Corner. Headed away. Back to Tellers. Two minutes left. Alex Tellers. Dinked into the box. Bruno keeps it alive. Cavani! Come on! Edinson Cavani! Well, it's really top class play. This is a lovely goal, just simply because this is what Cavani's about. One touch, bang! Right in the onion sack. That's what I'm talking about. Great finish. Well, Derek, you wouldn't expect semi so we make it through to the final, which will be contested against the Ajax. Times, That'll be on Wednesday. The and hopefully the we can win that final well and get some extra money. Cavani was sensational so again today. Well Come off the bench to provide the second goal. Well, that was a really, really More good of the same, please. The really I love it. With that goal, I'm sure he is. Alright guys, so I want you to join me on Wednesday, hopefully I'll have episode 2 out by then, uh, around 6pm UK time, and uh, we'll be taking on Ajax in the final of the Shield, and finishing off the summer transfer window, I've been working on some deals, hopefully I can get those across the line and improve the team before the start of the opener against Spurs. Join me for the next episode, if you did like it, smash the like button, leave a comment, I'll see you guys soon.